Hello, Richard here from Clevewood Park in Wollacombe, North Devon. Today, I'm going to show you around a brand new addition to our holiday homes that we have here on our Clevewood Heights development. It's a 41 foot by 13 foot, two bedroomed Langham Lodge. Absolutely stunning. Has just arrived. We haven't quite, just as of yet, put the decking on. But this particular home is quite unique in the aspect that is a centre lounge configuration, which means where I'm stood in the middle of the home, you'll find the lounge on this side, which we'll go over very shortly. And then you'll also find a fabulous designer kitchen on the opposite side. And then either side of the home, through that door there, you'll find bedroom number two. And over this side behind the kitchen through that door, you'll find bedroom number one, the main principal bedroom. But first of all, let me quickly show you around the lounge. One of the fab aspects about the centre lounge configuration is that it really is indoor, outdoor living. You've got a fabulous size set of French doors leading out of the lounge area onto what will be uh, over 300 square feet of sun decking, which will run all the way down the side of the home where you can see the gravel base that we've laid already. That will all be fabulous decking and it's south facing. And actually when you sat on the decking, you won't see this in this video because it's a little bit gloomy out there today, but you do have sea views down over Woolacombe Bay to the west. So a super sunny deck, lovely bright and airy. You've got the main entrance door with a fixed window next to it, the French doors. And as we discover into the bedrooms, you'll also see that you've got French doors leading out onto the decking as well from both the bedrooms. So you've got a massive sofa, very chic, uh, very designer, super comfortable. Uh, matching footstool as well, which does have storage underneath. There's bags of storage throughout this home, there really is. You've got a feature log burner electric fire. Storage cabinets underneath as well for storing away those CDs or shoes or board games, so on and so forth. Provision on the wall there for adding, include adding a TV. It will come with a 43 inch television, this particular home, but you may want to upgrade it to a 50 or 55 inch because there's certainly ample space on that wall to accommodate that. And then it even also comes with its very own cocktail bar. How fantastic is that? Storage underneath are the mixers. You've got uh, plenty of storage for your glasses there and your spirits and your wines. And that's the lounge area. No sofa bed in this one, but the sofa, having said that, is super sized. It really is. It, you'd probably refer to it as a six or eight, even an eight seater sofa. It's absolutely massive. So that is the lounge area. Moving then into the kitchen, freestanding dining table and chairs, some super touches in the home with uh, lighting effects, which a lot of thought has been put into the lighting. You know, you've got under work top LED lighting, under cabinet LED lighting, and then you've got down lighters along the top of the wall cabinets as well. So a really nice way to create an ambience in the evening. Or if you're getting up out of the sofa after watching TV and you need another cold beer or a glass of wine you've got a full-size fridge freezer over this side and you won't be stubbing your toes on the table with the led lighting just glowing away which makes it comfortable to find the fridge uh the rest of the kitchen super really is you've got a five ring glass topped gas burner hob designer extractor electric oven super stylish basin you have then an integrated washing machine and you also have a Slimline dishwasher. Not forgetting, of course, the integrated microwave as well. And you have got bags and bags of cover space for food, for plates and all your crockery. So, you know, it really is a chef's delight, the kitchen. And very on vogue with the uh, concrete grey worktops. I'm slightly colour brand. They look concrete grey to me. Might not do to you. In this little cupboard here then, uh, another aspect that has been thought about in the designing of this home, you've got your cloakroom cupboard. So you've got your coat hooks up there and we've even remembered to put a plug socket actually in the cloak cupboard, which is ideal where you could mount the Dyson vacuum on that wall, keep it charged up. The flooring in the lounge area, uh, in, the, in the lounge area and the kitchen and dining area is a very hard wearing cushioned vinyl flooring which is super practical really easy to keep clean and uh, that's the lounge of the Langham we'll head into bedroom one so behind the kitchen you'll find a doorway which leads into the main principal bedroom one of the design features of this particular model is to make it more of a hotel boutique style accommodation so with a uh, virtually identical bedrooms either side 
This is the main master bedroom because this does have a super king size six foot bed. There's bags of storage with a super sized large oversized double wardrobe with drawers underneath. There's a dressing table area with drawers again which come out. Nice touches such as LED lighting so it's super bright and light over the dressing area. My wife always complains when we go to hotels. Our hotel rooms can be dark and dingy and she struggles putting her makeup on. I'm not commenting at all on whether or not she needs to spend lots of time with the bright light to put her makeup on, but sometimes she does look like Gigi the Panda. Anyway, there we go. So the master bedroom, either side you've got bedside cabinets, lovely feature designer hanging bedside lamps. And note as well the French doors which will lead out onto the uh, very private south facing decking, which will run all the way down the side of the home. Through this door then we'll venture through and I'll show you the ensuite shower room. It is absolutely super, it really is, my goodness. I do hope this is coming across on the video because uh, in person, the design aspects and the, the quality and the feel of the home is absolutely sensational. You've got a large double shower cubicle, his and hers, basins, lots of storage underneath, designer WC and lots of storage down here. You'll actually find through these doors, you'll find the home's valiant gas combi boiler. Uh, top of the range variant boiler, very energy efficient and that powers your gas central heating and also your hot water. So there we go, that's the master bedroom. We're going to slip slide back through this door and nip through the kitchen and the lounge and come and have a look at the other end of the home where you'll find the home's second bedroom. Size wise it's an identical size to bedroom number one. But in this room, we've uh, made a few changes, such as the headboard, which runs straight the way across the rear of the second bedroom. And that is because that these two three foot beds, the full size three foot beds, but they, have, uh, they are hotel style zip and link beds. So depending on who's visiting on any particular weekend, you can remove the bedside cabinet there by lifting it out, push the beds together, zip them up down the middle, and you do have a super king size bed, just like in bedroom number one. And also, just like in bedroom number one, you'll find you've got French doors as well as an opening window, which will lead out onto the home's sun decking. The sun's actually coming out outside there today. And you've got a matching dressing area. Large, super side, exactly the same size as the one in the principal bedroom, double wardrobe with drawers underneath. And you actually do have storage underneath the divan bases as well in both this room and the master bedroom. So bags of storage, really practical everything's been thought about it really has and even though it's bedroom number two you will find it does have access to its very own shower room i say very own shower room i'll explain more about that very shortly but uh, again very very similar size bags and bags of a storage space throughout large double shower cubicle super sized mirror over overlit with gu10 so nice and bright around the basins storage underneath design wc and additional storage as well that door there, mind you, that does actually lead through into the lounge. So we're back in the lounge, as you can see. Now, the idea of having these Jack and Jill doors are that if you do have friends around visiting, you may have made friends with neighbours next door, other holiday homeowners, then uh, if they're coming around for coffee or to share a drink from your cocktail bar, then they don't have to be walking through bedrooms in order to access the bathrooms. Instead, you have got access to the ensuite by the Jack and Jill doors, as you can see. So there we go. I do hope this video does it justice because this home is quite spectacular. Positioned on plot 28, sorry, I tell a lie, plot 29 here at Clevewood Heights. That's our Langham holiday home, super sunny and airy, a fabulous private decking and some great quality touches throughout. If you'd like to be one of the first to come and see the home for yourself in person, please reach out, get in touch, say hello, and we look forward to speaking with you. Bye-bye for now.